Now you know you have some people where some woman, you know, who help out them man every way possible. You understand? You know, because to all of the women them who believe in helping out them man. Now she explains says she meet this guy. When she meet him, him dep on him face. Not na go and feel him na make no money or nothing like that. Him na work. You understand? But as a woman should and as a woman would, a real woman, she decided to say, yo, she go help him out. Whichever way she can help him out. And she make him come move in with her. Now, I know some of you are going to say, yo, her first mistake that she make. But yeah, she said she make the brother come move in with her. Because nothing never did a go on for him and she want to help him. So he move and him come live a fear place. See? Now, she said him dead and she said she had brainstorm on ways in which, you know, she can get him to, you know, build him up a little bit better. You understand? So she said, she make a suggestion to him. She said, babes, you know what? I know not to go on for you and I want to help you out, you know. You know me there and I got your back. Right? So she said she suggests to him, say, she have to go to the bank and she have to get a loan. Right? So she have to go to the bank and she have to get a loan. Now, I know this again, most of you say, yo, second mistake that she make. Right? So she have to get the loan and she have to get a little car for him so he can put the car up on the road and, you know, get some money for start generate. You right? Be some little robot taxi or whatever. See it? In my boy said, yeah man, babes, me appreciate that man. Love you, see why me love you so much. Re, re, re. Boom, now, she go and she get the money from the bank. She got the bank and get the loan, you know. Get the loan now, get the money for buy the car. So she buy one little car. I think she said the car, the, the loan what she get was mostly like 600000 or something like that. You understand? And she said she get the full thing and she said she does give to the brother. And the car was mostly like, the car in buy was mostly like 400 and something thousand. You understand? Because it's a used car in buy. And she said, my boy does take the whole life money and not even give her back a short penny out tight. Now be in mind, you know. She said she get 600 and something from the bank. And she give him everything for buy the car. See? Fear name the loan in her, you know. More listen to me, you no know, people. She said she take everything and she just give him it. Right? My boy take the whole life money. Buy the car, the car was 400 and something thousand. Him buy the car, him now look back on her and give her a dollar out of the change or nothing. Now, she said, she still never mind that because she knows him never did make no money or whatever. So, she still never mind that. But she said she noticed that after him buy the car, she starts with some changes. Because she has said, no, him start make some money. Up to blessings. See? She has said, no, him start make some money. Now him life kind of change now. Things kind of turn around for him. Remember, you know, when she pick him up, nothing now go on for him. Him now work, him now make no money. Him basically never live nowhere. And she move him in to come live with she. A fear place where she pay the bills. See? And then she make a decision so she'll go get a loan and make him buy one little car so he can put on the road. Now she said, from she get him the car now, it's like she noticed my boy start treat her a different type of way. See? It's like she said my boy start treat her a different type of way. The way him used to talk to her is like him attitude change. See? Daily double blessings. It's like him attitude change. Him actions towards her change. The way him used to treat her change. See? So she said she start observe all of them things there. See? She said she start observe all of them things there and start to notice. So they were going big up and start to notice say. Him true colors start to come out now. See? Boom now she say. One day my boy go up on the road and thing and she noticed him start to come in some late night. See? When her things were things that we never used to do. She said she noticed him start coming in some odd hours at night now because he get care now. So him there a road and thing and him a do what he want to do. And she said. One day she just simply said to him, say, babes, why you come in so late at night time? Come on now. You know, you know, you know, some day I'm concerned about you. She said, my boy, tell her, cool. Say, yo, my girl, what you try to do? Control, man. Me a man. You can't tell me when you come in at the house and them things. But she said, babes, me not try to control you. But just say, these are things that you never used to do before. So why all of a sudden you start go out now and I come in some odd hours at the night without calling me and telling me, well, you're going to come home late. You don't feel like me concerned. You don't feel like me worried. 
You know, feel like more of it, no, say so you're alright. And she said, My boy start chat to her some way where he never used to talk to her. See? And she said she feels so insulted and disrespected. But she has said, Boy, you know, she just brush it off. But this is how things get interesting now, people. And this is how more want to start telling me now what I want to think. She said, My boy, go missing for a whole weekend. She said, my boy, I'm missing for a whole weekend. No call, no text, no WhatsApp. And when she try to call him, no answer. Phone just a ring off of the hook. And him now pick up. So she said, she'll get concerned. She'll get worried because, you know, she don't know where him there. See? She'll get concerned. She'll get worried. She don't know where him there for a whole weekend. And she don't hear from my boyfriend. She don't see the car. She don't know what I go on with him. Now watch ya. Maybe see who they are listen. I pay attention. And I keep up with what I go on. Where do you think? My boy there. For a whole weekend where she not hear from him. What the story where do you think him come with? For say, I saw him did there. Or this go on. Maybe see if you don't pay attention. Now keep up with what I go on. Now go tell me you know. But more want to see if you not keep up. Because people, the next part of it, when she said to me, I said, hey? Up top said, girl yard, woman yard. <laughs> no man, him not go tell her, I said, I did say him did that. Me I say, what do you think of the story where him come with? What the story where you think him come with? If you tell her, I say, yo, I this go on, why you not hear from me over a whole weekend? And that me I say, I want to tell me, what want to think of the excuse where him come with? See it? GS and blessings. See me? My boy hear an excuse, but when me hear the excuse, me I say, nah man, eh 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 eh. He was visiting in Grania country. <laughs> Family member, yeah. Alright, let me tell you now what go on now. So she said when, hey, Maya, ya yeah, keep up with what go on. See Maya, ya, yeah, Maya, yeah, keep up. So she said, when, my boy finally turn up. When my boy finally surface people, my boy come and tell her, I say, him be get lock up. Police have him lock up. See? And that's why him couldn't answer him phone. That's why him couldn't call her because police have him lock up. Now, you know why I hear the next interesting part of him story? If you know why you're the next interesting part of your story, let me, say, let me see some flames in the comment section, man. Send in the flames, them. If you know why you're the next interesting part of my boy's story, send in the flames in the comment section right now. Come here, go tell you the next part of, the, of, of, of my boy's story. The man said police lock him up. That's why he couldn't answer his phone. That's why he couldn't call her. That's why she not see him for a whole weekend. But I want to see some flames first before I move forward. More see some flames so we move forward. See? The next part of the thing is this, people. The next part of the thing is this. My boy say, him get bail. And when him get bail, guess how who come bail him? Him no call, him no call, him girlfriend where him live with, he come bail him, you know? I want to listen to me you know, people. He did not call him girlfriend where he lived with for come bail him. You know? Guess who he called for come bail him. And these are the excuses the man give him present girlfriend where he lived with. Who can tell me who he called for come bail him? The man said, him did have to call him baby mother for come bail him. You know hear me? The man tell her, I say, him get lock up. The man tell her, I say, him get lock up. See? For a whole weekend. That is why, him girl na hear from him. For the whole weekend. And that is why, him couldn't call her. And that is why, she couldn't reach him. And, when the police then finally give him bail, him did have to call him baby mother to come bail him. Now that sound right to no people. Come now. 
When me logical thinkers them there. That sound right too, no? More wanna tell me if that sound right too, no? See? That no sound right to me, none at all when she said that. See? Him did have to call him baby mother to come bail him when him get locked up. Now, my question to you, family. If you get locked up, you either go call a family member to come bail you or if you have a partner, you go reach out to your partner first before you reach out to anybody else. Definitely, you're not going to reach out to your baby mother first. Am I wrong or am I right? See? Am I wrong or am I right, people? You definitely would not reach out to your baby mother first before you reach out to your present partner. And if you do that, what excuse could you possibly have if you do that? You see me? So, my question to the girl when she tell me all of that, me say, me ask her, me ask her straight up, me say, you ever see any signs like him and the baby mother still have things that go on because that no sound right to me? She said, you know, say, me did kind of suspect something that go on because more time, you know, him and the baby mother, we have some conversation where, you, you understand what I say? And him always I tell me, say, I'm a baby mother this, so, you know, me can't get feel a type of we or whatever. And you understand? Now, more want to tell me what to think now, people. Kizzy, big up yourself, me see you. More want to tell me what to think for all of you here we go on. What want to think really are go on? So just in case she dep on the live here and her ear and I see you no comment, she can't see. Because that's what she says. She says she want to see the feedback of the people. See? What do you think? What do you really think him did that over the weekend? Me believe the baby mother part, you know. Who do not get me wrong? I believe the baby mother part. Me believe the baby mother part. See? But the bailing part, how I don't no believe. The bailing part, how I don't no believe. The whole, me get lock up part, how I don't no believe. You see me? Me believe said the baby mother was in the picture somewhere there. But me not believe said him did get lock up. Kimi wa go on. See? Me feel like I'm baby mother yard him did them all yeah. Exactly. Me feel like I'm baby mother yard him did them for real. For the weekend. You understand what I say? The lock up part no sound right up top. See? The, the lock up part no sound right. Because people, come on man, real talk. If you get lock up and police finally give you bail, you not call your ex to come bail you. You call your present partner first before you call anybody else. Worse if you know if worse if you know say you not talk to your partner for a whole weekend. Come on, man. Come on, sense. <laughs> but you say meaning lock them with the baby mother. I must not go on. See, I must listen to me. He must they lock them with the baby mother people. You understand? Because the man's story no make no sense. The man's story no make no sense. But hold on. Hold on. Listen this now. You know why your story come to bump now? Kizzy, you miss the whole light. Kizzy, you miss the whole light. You know why your story come to bump now? You know why I hear all the man's story sound like nonsense? You know why I give you another side? Flames, 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 flames. Flames me no man. Me say flames me for no one me give you the rest of the man nonsensical story. Flames me no man. Flames me. If you no want me give you the rest of it. If you no want me give you the rest of it. Flames me cause it get even more interesting. <laughs> the man nonsense get even more interesting. Believe me. Here we go on now. So me ask one girl, me say, alright, so him get lock up. Why him say him get lock up for? Me don't remember really what she said the police pull him over for, but what I can remember, I asked her, I said, well, him get lock up, him get bail, so that means him have a court date. She said, yes. So me say, where him court date for? She said, him not tell her. Me say, alright, so 
he would have gotten some kind of ticket or something for sure say so he go to court. Right? She said, she asked him. So she want to see it. Who can tell me where my boy tell her I say? Mohan don't tell me what to feel like my boy tell her I say when when she says she want to see the slip where him get for the police station for sure say him have a court date let me see if you don't keep up with what go on see it let me see if you don't keep up with what go on he lost it eh eh I know that him baby mother of them brownstone <laughs> up top you're close you're close baby mother of it Close, close. The man tell the girl say him give the slip to the baby mother auntie because the baby mother auntie work at the courthouse and she can take it out of the system. So him not have the slip. You never hear some nonsense people. But this are after now, the first time, this is after she asked him where he slept there, the first time him tell her, he said he slept there in the yard. See? That's how she, that how he tell her the first time. He said he slept there in the yard. So she said, when she go to the yard now and say, Mo, I want to see the sleep. My boy said, you know, I said, I'm going to be with my mother auntie because she work at the courthouse and she can't take it out. I assist him. So I don't have it, you know. Now if that na spell lie, if that na spell lie, people, me no know what spell lie. Real talk. Eh? Them man tell a story left, right, and center everywhere around. Them man tell a story, people. You understand? But my girl no dance. She no dance, you know, cause she know say something no smell right. So that's why she called me and she said, "Answer, but more you listen to this, you know. More you tell me what you think. See?" She said, more you tell me what you think. Because it just not sound right. More often know if I'm here alone, stupid and stoppable. See? But my boy had come with a story where no make sense. He had come with a story where no make no sense. See? Because, first of all, if you get locked up by the police, you're entitled to a phone call. Now, if the police are going to keep you and decide to give you a bill, you supposed to call the first person who you feel like would be most concerned about you for one or eligible for bail you for two. The baby mother couldn't help him before, you know. Remember, say a home girl take, take him in her house. See? Remember, say a she go borrow money from the bank for give him care. So baby mother never did none at all financially for him. So how come all of a sudden baby mother able now to come bail him out of jail? You wouldn't call the most capable person financially to come bail you. Exactly Maya. Where was the baby mother when him the pan him face? That's what me I say right there. So. See? That's what me I say. So him story now add up. Him story no add up none at all. But I that the story where him try to sell one girl say, boy, you know, so me get locked up. You know, and that's why you never hear from me over the weekend. Cause me couldn't answer my phone cause the police them did have it. And me couldn't call you cause the police them did have it. And then when the police them finally give me bail, me call my baby mother, my baby mother come bail me. That no make no sense. So ladies, start to me now. What would you do in a situation like that for all of who hear the story from the beginning? What would you do in a situation like that? Let me see no comments right now. If you don't want to join the live, join the live. Send in a request and make we talk, ladies. Ladies, let's have this convo. What would you do? What would you do if I did you and a boy come try to sell you that story there? See it? A boy come try to sell you that story there and talk about so him get lock up. For a whole weekend and you know, hear from him. Now bear in mind, you know, lady be big up. Bear in mind, you know, 
She said after she get him the care my boy attitude towards her start change big time. See? Oh boy attitude start change big time. You understand? You see me? When you say I would have pack up him things in too damn bright. <laughs> you, listen me now man. But you know the part of the whole thing women are like though. You see, if a man no say you pick up a woman where you look out for your best interest. See? Super cat, pick up yourself. A man pick up a woman where you look out for him best interest. And would I do anything for him for help him out? You know, take pick him up off him face when him dump on him face. And then your you dog are out at the end. Me not like them thing there. See? Me not like them thing there. You meet a good, and I see a man like them there, break a good woman, you know. Me not say good woman no out there again, you know, but a man like them, they make, make good woman switch. Me wrong I'm right, people. A man like them, they make good woman switch, because it's when the good woman, them run across some of them boy, yeah. See? And them dog them out like that, the woman, them say, you know what, never again. Never again. I mean, the, the good woman, them heart get cool. And that type of problem, you know. The boy, them, we get some good woman, and the good woman, them, they in them corner and look out for them for the fullest. And would I do anything for them? See? And then, after you get a good woman, you decide, say, you want to dog her out and treat her the worst. Can remember, you know? She said the man whole attitude towards her change. She said at first, my boy used to be the nicest. He used to come home and rub her feet and give her all a massage. And you know, if she want, if she come home from work tired, my boy would have a fit, bring her in her bathroom and shower and all of them things there. See? But after she go get loan and get him care, my boy attitude change. My boy, whole attitude changed towards her. No longer the kind of person again where dead if you are. See? Start coming late night now. And I tell her, I say, yo, man, a man, no question me when I about what time if you come home and all them things there. But she not question him. She is simply saying, babes. If you're out and you know you're going to out extra late, at least send me a message. At least call me and say, you're going to come home a little bit late tonight. But not come in some odd hours at the night where we're not used to. You see, it, would have, it was a difference if that was him from day one, you know. She would have known, say, boy, I saw him stay and at them kind of time, he normally come in. But then all of a sudden, him start do that. She not used to that, so she got question it. Exactly, there was a red flag for him by the car. See? For him by the car. But see, me tell her this straight up to. Me say, listen. For you go to the bank, go get the money in your name for buy the car for him, you're wrong. Me tell her that straight up. Yeah. Me tell her that straight up. Me say, you're wrong. You're wrong, 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 wrong. I mean, know some people, especially the man them right now, probably I say, boy, I'm stop probably I try to stop the man fool. But no, me not try to stop the man fool. Me I try to look out for the best interest of the girl. Me tell her, I say, she wrong. She should have never do that. See? Because guess what, me know? When she go do that and give him that money, they know, I fear her name, they pay the loan, so as she go get left in debt. As she have to pay about that. When him decides, say, yo, me go about my business, you know. See? When him decides, say, me go about my business, as she has left with that loan there, when she have to go pay back. You understand? So me tell her straight up, say, she wrong for that. She should have never do that. See? You have some man come across some good woman. We would have do anything for them. And them not realize what them have. Or them realize what them have and abuse it. And that's the problem with some man. You see me? 
And then you have some man where we have a good woman and run go to some woman where can't help them no we at all. See? You have some man we have good things in their possession and give it up for some weird things. May I tell you? So you have some people where have the prize possession and give it up for dirt. You have some people have the prize possession in their hand, you know, and give it up for dirt. Now I'm not saying that my boy baby mother are dirt and don't get me wrong. But what I'm saying is, if I baby mother you want David, you should have stay I baby mother. Me wrong I'm right people. Instead of going go traumatize the girl you know. Because I traumatize him, traumatize her heart, you know. And her feelings right now, you know. I make she probably not go and even look upon another man the way in which she did a look upon him, you know. And that, and that him do to she right there, so you know. See him? And that him do to she right there, so. So right you now, she come all, she come across all a man like all and stop me right now. And, you know, she never go, she never go care about me the same way like how she did care about him. Because she got, in, in her back of her mind, she got to say, I wonder if Unstoppable see him way like that boy there. What makes Unstoppable any different from that boy there? You think that she would have ever go to one bank again because she's going to get a loan for your next man? If you try and pick him up off her face, she would have never do that again. See? Move the boy in a fear horse. If you can live with her, after nothing now go and feed him, they don't put him face in her face, no money, he can't contribute to her house in no way at all. But the man hurt the girl after she pick him up. And enough of that are going. Enough woman out there. See? Enough woman out there. I pick up some man after them face. And then him turn around and stab her in her back. See? Exactly, Barn Sagittarius. And that may I say. The next man where she pick up, now go get her full hundred. She go hold back. And at that happen, you have a whole heap of woman out there get damaged by some boy like that. See? You have a, you have a whole heap of woman out there who get damaged by situations like that. Simply because, you know, them give a man a chance. And the man they take disadvantage of it. Good woman still exists on the door, get me wrong. Good woman still exists. But because of some idiot before the present man, they are hold back. So if she used to give her 100%, because of the boy them were hurt her before, she probably give her 60% now when she gets in her new relationship. And probably not even that much. See? Probably not even going to give you that much. Because she has said, listen, I've already been down this road. I've already heard all the stories. See? I've already heard all the stories, so I'm not going to fall for that again. You understand? <laughs> Up top, you're right. A 600 she gave him. A two. <laughs> Most of you probably understand, but if you're there all along, you will get, you will get what Up top mean. A two. See? Real talk. You know, so if you allow just a forward and not get the gist of the story because you probably missed the beginning, watch it over and you will understand what we did at talk about. You know, but I just say for the man, them boy, when you meet a good woman, treat her like she deserves to be treated. And if you know you don't really want her, just keep it moving. Nobody damage her. You understand what I say? Because when you damage her, you only pass her and damage goods to the next man. And, 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 and her heart is shattered. If you know you don't really want her, just keep it moving, man. It's plain and simple. And ladies, keep your eyes open too. 
Because you have some boy out there all the mad who are using you. See? Some boy out there all the mad who are using you and get what they can get off of you. Men hardly exist these days, you know. I love you know that. Real men hardly exist these days. Because there's some little boy they bought right now where, where I look for women to take care of them. You don't know that, right? You don't know say, there's some boy they bought right now where I look for women to take care of them. I look for women to buy them name brand shoes and name brand clothes and as simple as give them money if you go cut them here and them thing there. Men hardly exist these days. See it? So ladies, when you pick up a man, be careful. Be very careful. Because some of them just they, they, uh, uh, look for the next victim where them can say, alright then, maybe me can go up on that one here and get one good piece of change off of she and then move on to the next one. And ladies, be very careful of the man them with a message on the, you know, on the inbox too. Because of them, it looks muddy for you. Believe me. So by the time if you get a message from, from a brother in Jamaica, if a Jamaica is there, he doesn't chat to you no more. Because he looks for somebody, a woman with their foreign. So that alone should be a red flag for you. Get a message from somebody, from a, from a brother. Boy, you look nice and I'm going to love to talk to you. And I mean, you start to talk to you. Just tell him, say, I'm here you live. <laughs> and tell him, say, you have four picnic. And tell him, say, you're not work. And tell him, say, you're not going to eat tomorrow. Message, stop coming. Miriam, blessings. Yeah, man. When they start message, you tell them about how nice you look and they would have love to get to know you. All in a, all in a, all in a fire in your living you know, just tell them say you live in Jamaica. You and your four picnic them. Just to see where your head is. I mean, guarantee conversation cut. Because if you live in Jamaica and you have four picnic and you have nothing to feed, to eat tomorrow, you might go, say, Cho, she doesn't have nothing to give me. And she can't help me if you come a foreign neither. See it? So be careful of that. Because enough of that go on on social media. Be careful of that. And all when you meet them in a real life, be careful of them too. Because some of them just look to see what you have. So that they can come and take it. I mean, no, me have some successful ladies here. You have to be very careful. Because some boy just watch out your, your, your assets. See? <laughs> but you say the poor pity thing is a big turn off. But that's the point. You need to turn them off. Because you know say them are not clean from the beginning. And their motives were untrue from the beginning. So you need to turn them off. See? Let me tell you something. If me I go see a lady on social media now. If I was into that kind of thing, see it? I'm going to go in her inbox and I'm going to tell her how beautiful she looks. She looks and boy, you know, so I'm go through your picture, the man. You look so nice and your body look right. I'm going to love forget for know you. And then she said to me, say, you know, me have four kids. So if I was being genuine and I tell her, I say, her body look nice and her body look good. I'm going to love forget for know her. That simply means having four kids. Did not destroy her body. So therefore, I should still be interested even finding out that she has four kids because her body still look good. Remember, I know before me know that she has four kids, I was telling her, oh, her body look nice and her body look good. Me wrong, I'm right, lady. Start to me. So obviously, if your body look good before, you tell me, say, you have four kids, then your body should still look good in my eyes if you tell me, say, you have four kids. Lady, start to me. Am I wrong or am I right? Wrong I'm right. Wrong I'm right. And by the way, if you do have four kids, you should tell a man you have four kids. No hide it. Because if a man really interested in you, he might be interested in you and your four kids. 
Again, wrong or am I right? If a man really interested in a you, he might go interested in a you and your four kids. Tell me if my right or my wrong, people. If my right on the burn up the chat, man, I don't know my life is in the flames, you know. Burn up the chat if my right. See? And also, if you have four pitney and you tell a man, say you have four pitney and him frown span it, run him. Burn up the chat again if my right. If him frowns even in the slightest bit, if him shrug a little bit, run him, burn up the chat. Because if a man can't accept you and your four pitney, you don't want him. If a man will claim that him interested in a you, can't accept you and your pitney, then you don't want him. He's not the one for you. If I fax me a chat, burn up the chat for me there. Make Instagram of a call the fire brigade over here today. See? Make Instagram of a call the fire truck over here tonight. Cause I be a flames. More as each other burn up. If you attack to a man and he was so interested in you before in find out how much pitney you have. And after you tell him how much kids you have, him lose interest. He is not the man for you. Because you want a man where you're going to love you and love your picnic them just the same way. Just the same way. See? Because any girl now want me, I'm a two daughter, try to go chuck off. <laughs> See you, so. And it goes to, yeah, it goes to the ladies too. It goes for the ladies to, you know, um, up top. If me attack to a woman and I tell her, listen, you know, so I have two kids and she not like that. So be it. Go on your way, baby. Me not interested in you because if you're not, if you're not going to accept me and my two kids, then so be it. Go your way. Because me no want no woman when I like picnic. Me no want no woman when no like pitney. See? So if you want a man when I have no pitney, go look a man when I have no pitney. But one thing me na go do, me na go hide my pitney them from no woman. Me na go tell a woman say me not have no pitney, just for she like me. Me go tell her straight up say babes, me have two pitney. You good with that or not? If she say, uh, you know, I say me never want a man we have pitney. All right, then. Nice knowing you. Nice conversation. Goodbye. Where fire them there? Ladies, come on, man. When me did a talk on phone side, we need to burn up the chat. Now me attack on the man them side. We don't feel burn up the chat same way because I fax me attack. I fax me attack. So we don't feel burn up the chat same way. See it? Big up yourself, Sagittarius. See it? No woman should accept a man that will not love her kids the same way as him claim him love her. See it? And no man should not accept a woman that will not love his kids the same way as in clear as as she claims she's going to love him. Plain fox. Plain fox. See it? And while we are on that note, too much woman put man over them pitney. For fox me attack on the phone on the bone of the chat. If a fox me attack on a bun up chat. Too much woman put man over them picking it. Who no need to stop it. Come now man, me not see you now bun up a chat. How foolish is me attack then? How foolish is me attack then? Me not see you now bun up a chat. Me say. Too much woman put man over them picking it. Who no fit tap it. See? 
Someone wanna left on a picnic in a bed at night time and gone a man yard and nobody na dead if you watch a picnic. Ono fi stop it. Ono fi stop it. If a boy can't understand say you have picnic and you know nobody fi watch your picnic when you want you fi come over and him a go tell you say Boy, you look like you're not interested in me, you know, because every time man asks to see you, you tell me about you know, no babysitter. Tell the boy this if you hold him corner, because your picnic come first. Where flame them there? Where flame them there? Where they flame them there? If a boy, you go look by you and tell you, say, look like you're not interested because every time him talk to you, you tell him, say, you're not a babysitter. Run him. Cause your picnic come first. See? If you're not a babysitter, you're just not a babysitter. And you're not going to leave your picnic in a house alone. At night time, I'm going to man yard. See? You're not going to do it. And to the mother them we are do that to no fi stop it. But no one hear something else too. No one hear something else too. And when me say this, no one just burn up a chat. No one hear something else. The one them we are bring on a baby. Go lay down beside man. We want to just know. I want to grind at night time with no baby beside you. No one fi stop it. Yes, Mr. Grind. That's what I said. Uno fi stop it. You just meet a man and kill your baby gone and your gun lay down beside him on the same bed. And I do no business beside the baby. Uno fi stop it. Pitney have sense these days. When you think Pitney has sleep, then lay down so with one eye open. And I watch and listen. Everything. Uno fi stop it. You know hear me? Me say, the woman them, we just meet a man, and because him a pressure on us, and want some pum pum. See? You know, take on a picnic. Some of you have some young girl, you know, some five year old, or some six year old, or some four year old young girl. And you know, bring on a young daughter, go a man, yeah, go lay down on the same bed. Because man a pressure you say, want some pum pum. And you gone a man yard with your young daughter and lay up on the same bed and because you say, you, you think you're asleep, man. You baby asleep, man. That time the picnic lay down there with one ear, crack and watch and listen everything. Oh no, if you stop it. Look on the one of my burn out a couple months ago. Most of you probably would have remember. Look on the one of my burn out a couple months ago. When literally of a young baby in her and while she a profound filet she up on a man. Me that fit burn her out. Cool, cool, cool. Literally have a young baby in her hand so. And a profound filet she up on a man. Fee all a who no know what name filet she up. She did a profound oral sex on a man. With a young baby in her hand. And me that fit burn her out. And while she a profound filet, she up on the man, the baby a push one crackers in her mouth. And she just come, she just come after the man so, and turn around and eat the crackers that the baby a put in her mouth and then she gone back. What kind of mother do things like that? Now, now definitely we have to burn out the man too, man. Cause him no better. Him no better. So him get burn out too. Him get born out too. But remember, you know. Man a dog. Man a dog. Plain and straight. But she should have known better as a mother. Him no better, you know. Don't get me wrong. 
But she should have known better. As a mother, you have to hold your young baby in your hand like this. And a profound oral sex for a man. And then you take the cocky out of your mouth. And then turn around and make your baby put one crackers in your mouth. And then you go back to... Come on, man. Come on, man. Up top said the man probably has spent money. I want to show you said the man probably not even has spent a dollar per night. That I think the man probably not even care about her. And her pitney. I probably want a new man where she just meet. And then probably a pressure her to come over. And she decides, say, you know, I'm go. Or uh, 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 she probably invite him off your yard. Because a man will care about her and her picnic would never do that in, in, in the presence of her child. Come on now. See? A man will care about her and her picnic would never do that in the presence of her child. If a fox me attack, I'm not burn up the chat for me there. A man that cares about her genuinely would not do that in the presence of her child. And she never have nothing about herself neither. I probably want a new man she meet. I'll probably have the same night to me not put it past her. Because if she do that in front of her picnic, she probably she don't know more else. So she probably just meet all at them on the same time. See him? No, men are dogs. No, 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 no. Miss Camille, men are dogs. It is the truth. Miss Camille say, I hate that you call men dogs. It is the truth. Men are dogs. Because a dog. You see a dog? Come on, Miss Camille. You see a dog? We see any female dog out there, and as long as she has, she has heat, and you cannot dispute this Camille. A, 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 a dog, a male dog, we see any female dog out there as long as she have heat him around for go jump it. Am I wrong or am I right, Camille? Am I wrong or am I right, Camille? As long as you see a female dog and she on heat, him around for go jump it. I saw some man stay. And bear in mind, I said some. I saw some man stay. Some man only want to see a map stick and it look like it have on a skirt. He won't jump it. Some man only wants to see a map stick will look like it have on a skirt and he will jump it. Mm -hmm. So no put nothing past man. Don't take man lightly. And bear in mind, I said some. Because you have some man we have morals. Yeah, you have some man we have morals and standards where wouldn't jump a map stick. <laughs> See? But put them in at the right scenario too. You still can't put nothing past them. May I tell you no? Mm. But I'm just saying. But seriously, men needs to hold each other accountable. Men? Why you say men need to hold each other accountable, um, Camille? Me not understand. Camille, join the live, man, and chat to me. Explain that. Are you shy? Like Kizzy? Because Kizzy has said she's shy and she's not, she not camera friendly tonight. Are you shy, Camille? Join the live! Explain. You can even turn off your camera if you want to. Me not mind. Explain your, 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 your stance. You see me? Dogs leave their neighborhood and come to other neighborhood fight. Do you hear me? Exactly. <laughs> Achoo. Achoo. Dog we left for the... Listen me. Dog we stray from one neighborhood and go into the other neighborhood for a female dog we, we, and heat. Achoo. Me I tell you. Hmm. Now man up top, the ladies them shy tonight. I don't know why. Ladies them afraid to join the conversation. I don't know. They're probably afraid to put them in the ad seat. <laughs> ladies them afraid tonight. I don't know why. You see me? But more, 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 the ladies them join me. More, more, the ladies when they are tonight join me in the conversation. But they're afraid. 
they're shy. I never know so much shy lady they on the live in a night, yeah? You see me? I never know so much shy lady they on the live. You know? But real talk. Some serious things, you know, and, and, and this is not a man or a woman thing. It's a human thing. We need, we need to have morals, man. Especially where kids, you know, in the midst. You understand? We need to have some serious morals. And we need to understand that we should take, you know, having morals seriously. You know? Certain things you should not do in the presence of children. Because, unlike one time, Pitney no dumb again. Two year old these days, very, very, very smart. Very, very, very smart. Two year old. So when you think that you're talking or doing certain things in the presence of a child, believe me, and you think that them not understand, believe me, them understand. Them know exactly what you say and them know exactly what you do. Kids these days are very smart. So nobody take it lightly. Nobody thinks that them don't know what you do. See? If you have your boyfriend and you want to catch one little piece, wait until the picnic go to school or, or, or try to make one of your sister them or your brother them or somebody, you know, watch the, watch the picnic for one hour or so. And then you catch your little quickie and go back for your picnic. If you live in a one, one bedroom, you live in a in one room. But nobody, nobody try to do certain things in the presence of your child. Because when your thing say, the people don't know what you do, they know. See? They know. Now when you think the people don't know what you say, they know. So if you want to catch one little quickly, wait till the pit in your presence to do it. And that is the reason why some of our children so slack these days because them see them parents do it. See? People, excuse my language for me I'm going to say right now. But you know what I say? I see one video over there and someone who got shocked. Someone now got shocked. And when I saw the video, the people in the background that was recording the video were adults. And I listened to the adults talking and laughing when the child said what, they, what, what he said. See? In the video, as I say, excuse my language for me, I'm going to say right now. But in the video, these were two young, young kids. Couldn't be no more than about four or five cars. You could have seen it. The young boy was telling the little girl, listen to me now, people, as I say, excuse me for this. Was telling the little girl, boy, would I love to eat that pussy? They were, they were some American kids. I would love to eat that pussy. And the, the adult people, them daddy, I record and I grin them teeth and I laugh. What was in that to be funny? To hear a child telling another child that. When as an adult, you should be the one to correct them and say, Hey, hey, uh-uh-uh-uh-uh. We are tabo. Why you know about eating whatever you say you want to eat? At four or five. Why you know about that? But simply because them hear and see adults say and do things like that that's why they repeat it and believe me 
give them the privacy and they probably would try it at four and five. And him probably would know how to do it too. Because him probably see his adult parents doing it. So give them the privacy and the time and them probably would try it at four and five. Right? They probably would try it. Because they know how it's done. Because kids are no longer kids anymore. Kids are very smart these days and then pick up. And when you think you're talking a codes, they understand what you're talking. They know exactly what you're talking. 